Hey, what's up, guys? So, welcome to another episode, and today we're we'll reviewing uh, GPT 02 Soaring Ascent as part of our series of videos that look back on 2015. Yeah, and review as yeah. promised. Uh, Daigo here with uh, Katsu, as usual. Yeah. And uh, but before we get to that, we're gonna announce the winners for our giveaway. Yeah, uh, uh, we, have a we have a Tommy Low, Tommy Low, and, and uh, Sean To. Sean To. So who voted, uh, who actually liked our video? So yeah, so you guys be notified by uh, Facebook. So do keep a lookout. And congrats on getting your playset. Yep. Hey, okay. so uh, let's get into the pack opening. Wait a minute before you go there. Uh, oh, the previous set, oh, which yes. you forgot to mention, was that they actually had uh, specials. Uh, in, in, in yeah, so the, the best boosters. The box yeah. topper included your Sort Me PT01, but you also had Signed Striders. Signed Strider. So the notable thing was uh, these two were in. These two were in the main Easter. set. This, this was, was a box topper. Yeah. So, yeah, all so the box toppers. This card is now reprinted in this set as a rare. But uh, if you bought the, bought the first set as one box, you do get a signed version of it. Okay. One random one, one random, random one, per yeah. box. So if you bought a few yeah. boxes, you might watch it. And uh, surprisingly, all the signed. Is actually from the voice actors yep. of the main characters, uh, Chrono, Shion, and uh, Tokoa. Tokoa. Yep. Yes. Very, very cool. So uh, let's get to it. Yeah. Okay, it's my name. Let's get to it. Let's see. let's see what we get. I hope it's a foil. Yes. yes. Okay. So this time around, this set features a new actor. Ah, uh, uh, no, so no point. point. And. Uh, Okay, let's see what we have. We do have foil. What do you oh, know? whoa, 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 we have a foil. Okay, this, we don't have this guy. So, um, he's, uh, he's a Echo Force, Double R, Michael. He um, with, uh, the new, uh, with a new, uh, the mate. Milos, Milos. 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 He's actually a Legion Tidal Assault. Yeah, so the same effect as Tidal Assault, but, but because Legion. Legion. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so, um, so moving on, the main highlight, the whole set, is definitely a GR. It's called Super Flash. Beauty, she's a real beauty. So Premier is uh, like a uh, Chronos Command type of uh, card, which is a very one one off thing. It, okay, the skill is. It actually helps you reproduce the field. Okay, the skill is auto, count of blast 3, choose 5 normal units from your drop zone and put them at the top of the deck in any order. Then choose a card from your hand and discard it. So when this card attacks the Vanguard, you pay the cost. If you do choose up to 2 of your rear guards and search the deck for up to 2 units uh, with the same name and call. So what happens is um, if you have two units on the field and you use an effect, you get to call four units and replace the other two or Whoa. empty spaces as well. Well, I can see this being a very good counter the uh, retiring, retiring base decks. But uh, usually the issue is that um, you will not have the counter blast for it. Uh, but it's, nice heavy, it's a heavy cost. Yeah. Nice idea. The Koha is just it is a GR. Just yeah. it there, it. And it's a pretty beauty. Yep. Mm -hmm. Very nice. And uh. Some other cards that this set uh, gave us. Uh, uh, now Kami really got a boost. In the form of a uh, in the form of a strike and the strike unit. Strike unit, yeah. Conquest. And, and there's uh, yeah. This is Nauru. So Conquest uh, stayed as a staple in, in all Nauru decks even up to now. Yep. Uh, its skill is once per turn we choose a copy of yourself and flip face up. The number of face up cards in your G zone is two or more after that. Choose one of your opponent's rear guards in the front row and retire it. Then all units get plus 5k for every open. So if opponents have no rear guards, it's 10. So it's really, really good. numbers. So Naru has, if I believe, no other way of gaining that kind of power on strike turns. I mean, not on strike turns, in general. In general, but this one helps it, you know. Yeah, and, and the it's, uh, it doesn't require any specific card that you can use at all Naru decks. If your opponent decides to play smart, don't call rear, so you're like, okay, let's go. Yeah, and good. you get the powers. Yeah. And uh, Vanquisher here. Uh, started the new uh, mechanic that Naru had, which is Bind Zone. Yeah. So, this effect Painful. is uh, uh, when you strike a unit over him, pay a cost calm plus one. Uh, if you do, choose a bonus card in the front row and retire it. Uh, retire and bind that card. So, mm. bind it face up. Yeah. So, bind means you can't legion, and if you don't play another Naru. No, you know what? I think you can't, you can't use the kindness to bring down maybe or something. Yep. Yeah. And uh, the GB2 effect. When your opponent's rear guard is going to drop some due to effect one of the cards, this unit gets plus 3000 and one critical. So it's um like. What's the card's uh, name? Blade Master. No, 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 it's um. It's. It's a brawler unit, I think. No, Eradicator. The, the punching gun. Eradicator. Uh, no, I remember mean, it's the season with Boeing Sword break, right? Yeah, then now he used that card and then he like. Palm Blast 2 and Blast Power and Quick Power and Quick Power and. Quick. Power break? No, 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 it was in the first wave. His first few ace cards, not already before, right? Yeah. 
yeah, but uh, basically, um, I'm sure you, maybe some of you know uh, the card that every time you reti something retires, it gets plus 3k. And oh, oh I, I think I know who. The, the who is it? Thunder guy. I, uh, yeah, the, the punching guy. Yeah. But yeah, it's, um, it's a similar effect. Similar effect to this. So it's quite cool uh, because it's all Naru. So hey, speaking of Naru, um, Sally, which the other card we don't have, which is double R here, uh, is actually uh, Legion Revival. Yeah, so um, Vermillion. Vermillion a Revival. was chosen to be the. Uh, yeah, Given so high fans, high fans rejoice. Yep. So yeah, uh, Vermilion got revival in the form of Crimson. But his skill is uh, while he's in Legion, the cost of limit break for your mate is it's reduced to zero. zero. So you have now a free cost way to whack your opponent's front row, mm -hmm. Vermilion. And if you recall earlier, uh, earlier down the years, we had uh, limit removers. Yeah. So you put those two together upon Legion, you just make yeah, the front row regardless of what damage. Yeah, which yeah, is very, so very, nice. Very, very nice. Very and it's very painful. Yeah, and uh, of course, like up to now, uh, it's still it's still being used, so it's definitely good. Yep. Okay. So other than Naru and uh, Alco, uh, well, since we're on the same topic of uh, Alco Force here, Alco Force. Uh, you want to talk about Ace card? Which yeah. The hype. So uh, we have uh, uh, Lambros. Lambros here, which uh, is SP, but that's not important. Exactly. But yeah, uh, okay. we have Lambros here, and um, even though Primavera was so called the uh, GR, but it wasn't GR. really exactly the hype of it. It wasn't even the most expensive card. Yeah. So. Well, we the biggest hype was Lambros though, because Lambros was uh, very... It's dope. It's dope. very good. Yeah. <laughs> so, so um, Lambros really helped the Arca Force kind of uh, achieve, uh, achieve something in, in yeah. here and we kind of broke the classic 3 top decks at the time. Yep. So uh, Lambros skill is when he attacks and if he is the 4th battle or more, mm -hmm. uh, oh, choose oh, okay. 2 of your rear guards. Choose 2 of your guards. Uh, stand it. Stand, but you have to flip himself. Persona yeah, flip. Yeah, flip himself. So, is um then after they send two rear guards and if you have two or more face up units in the G zone, yeah, the they two, get plus the 10k. Two send the rear guards, get plus 10k. So this means you can use your first strike just to restand the rear guards, or you can use your second strike to get your plus 10. Plus 10. And, yeah. and uh yeah, naturally the it's a very pressure. It's a very pressure. Uh, pressuring yeah. this uh yeah, attack. Yeah, and um Uncle Force got more ways to achieve fourth battle, although I don't think we have the cut. We have the cut? Okay, but uh, no. doesn't matter, but uh, yeah, but Aquaforce got more ways to achieve the uh, 4th battle, battle, so using this is really, really easy. Yep, and speaking of 4th battle, in this set, uh, interestingly, Blue Storm, uh, Blue Storm cards has a new support in form of a great tool, which allows a Millstrom Swapper, which, you have, yep. which will actually allow you to have a 4th attack. Yep, so his skill is a, I think it's a um, Rascal Sweeper, Blue Sweeper. Sweeper. Storm, Rascal yeah. Sweeper. Uh, his skill is on the first battle, you may have him plus 2k, okay. then after that, after the battle, you swap him with a unit behind. behind. Yep. So it's it's uh, a classic uh, Aqua Force uh, swapping like Basil, um, but it's 11k and he, he can swap a donate gen generation break or anything like that. You just need a Millstrom Battle, which means you minimize the victory, yeah. but it's still really good. Yep. Very very useful, and in the common, so it's any end if you have Millstrom Battle. Yeah. And go through um, some other foil cards. So back to, the, uh, uh, back to the uh, main, main highlight of the cover booster, which is... Uh, Neo Nectar. Neo Nectar. So, Neo Nectar's uh, strike is Jingle Flower Dragon. And um, Jingle Flower is is good. I mean, it's essentially what uh, classic Neo Nectar is all about. Uh, cloning cards getting the same name on the field. Uh, its effect is once per turn, choose a uh, face down card named Jingle Flower, flip it face up. And if the number of cards you have face up in your G zone is two or more, choose one of the units. And during this turn, it gets cont. Uh, VC continuous effect. continuous effect. All units get plus two thousand for each unit of the same name. name. So, so what happens is if you full fill of all the same five rear guards of the same name, if you choose one of them, it hopefully gets plus ten k because it's five cards, five times two. All units get plus yeah. the amount of power. And, and no one actually specializing in duplicating units. Yeah. So this is a very very big boost. To, yeah, it's, uh, it's very good. It helps them uh, achieve like, the final turn kind of thing. Yeah, because they can duplicate, but if that's all they can do, they can't push. Can push so this but this really one actually good. balances up with a power boost. Yeah, and because it's Counter Blast 3, you can potentially kind of uh, use your Primavera to set up, and then if you don't get Bomb or something, next turn you go into this. Yeah, yeah. Still works. So the whole Neo Nectar in mm -hmm. this set is uh, back to the classic way of a floating yeah. unit. And also, Neo Nectar is a new Kanzen. Yeah, so. Not just Neo Nectar, actually. Uh, so the Neonatal Kanzen is very interesting. I like the rest of the, the, the current and paper Kanzen we have is that it's actually part of a sub plan. Yeah, Apple Force also has one as well. Yeah, so Neonatal one is part of the Maiden sub plan which I think at that time uh, it wasn't a real thing but they put the word Maiden, maiden anyway. Yeah. So if in the future there will be a Maiden card very useful. Aqua Force 
It's like the uh, uh, Royal Paladin and Gear Chronicle one, it's no sub clan. But uh, likewise, it all the same effect. The guard of it, same kind of drop zone. I put one. Yep. Got really, really nice. And of course, uh, some other clans were supported that were not uh, uh, very popular. I mean, they were popular because, but no one was interested in the cards because they're very satisfied with the builds, like Roy Pardon. Mm -hmm. So, Roy Pardon got support in the form of. G4, Samuel, Flashing Knight. Uh, Flashing Knight, Samuel. Divine Knight of Flashing Flame, Samuel. Yeah. So, Samuel's skill is when this unit attacks a Vanguard. Uh, if the number of cards your opponent damage zone is 4 or less, so they're not at 5, mm -hmm. plus 2 and um, sure opponent takes 1 damage yeah. and perform a damage check. So this is basically attack and use threat with a skill at call to plus 2. But however, it has to be a full field to achieve this effect. Uh, yeah, you have to have 5 more regards. 5 more regards, yep. So first problem people have with this is that if you're going to run Sing Saber, you immediately don't want to run this card because it's yeah, plus 2. Mm -hmm. If you're running... Um, and Any other build you have same blow, so you don't need this, this guy. Card. So it's pretty but underwhelming. The only good thing about him is that he can use first strike. Yeah, the first strike. He can actually shoot, potentially shoot a damage to five. Yeah. So if opponent gets nothing, you can actually kill opponent on first strike, which is yeah. really nice. However, uh, on the downside, the trigger actually activates. It does. So if they have, they have a trigger, it activates. Yeah. Yeah, that is the downside. But overall, it's, it's pretty, pretty interesting. Yeah. And um, they got some other stuff. I mean, this is just a common, but. It's been very relevant in, in Drone Knight, yeah. um, any most Metal Royal Party decks uh, as of today. Uh, they have uh, this card. On His skill is on call if you have uh, three or more oh, other Drone Knight Rail Guards. You may rest him and select another, unit. another Drone Knight unit and yep. plus 10k. Okay. So it, you can really see like this kind of thing. If you're playing Drone Knight tech in your deck, it's really, very really useful. Mm -hmm. You get an instant plus 10k. You can you get keep, instant free wear and instant, instant power boost. Instant free instant power boost will be very, very decent. Yep. And also, uh, Kree Elemental is a new uh, G4. Yeah, so previously, uh, I don't think we showed, but they actually received uh, Atmos, Atmos, which is when on the pack they get uh, Palm Blast 1 plus 10k. So now you have uh, Snow Element Blizzard. His skill is uh, on attack, Palm Blast 1, uh, flip a card, energy zone face up, any card. Then um, this unit gets plus 5000 for every face up, up unit. unit. Yeah. So it's uh, if you're running any kind of uh, deck that flips, like your Jingle Flower or Lumbros, this can potentially be your last strike. Yeah. So you have six units, mm -hmm. seven, wait, seven units face up. Yeah, seven, seven units face up, which plus is plus thirty five k. So it's a very decent it's a very finisher. Very big number. Your has no chance, and it's great for you. Yeah, yeah which high chance you won't have after going through yeah. all the Lumbros and all that. Okay, last but not least, as always, Gilcon. So Gilcon was supporting this set for Fate Rider. Yeah, support Fairy Rider. Yes, Fate Rider. So Fairy Rider's skill is once per turn, choose one of your rear guards, put the bottom of the deck, search the deck for up to one card that's a higher, bit higher than, than the, the one unit. That you mm. And choose one of your units for each face up card in your G zone, you get plus 3000. Yeah. Yep. So uh, you can choose the same card over and over again and uh, get power boost, or you can choose multiple cards to get power boost. Yep. Uh, but only downside, he doesn't flip. So he, I, I guess he can be kind of like a blizzard as a last strike get the power boost. Mm -hmm. uh, overall it's very good and cool to use it. Expected yeah. but yeah. Yeah so this set uh, really um it was aimed to help I believe it was aimed to help New Nectar because of the cover. Mainly New Nectar and Echo Force? No it was not even aimed to help Echo Force actually. Uh, Echo Force just got lung growth but yeah, it made uh the meta change slightly which is nice. Uh, An introduction Echo to Naru being a new uh, ability which yeah, really so Naru was like your anti um, strike anti deck. Anti deck, yeah. deck and now you have Blum Bros, which uh, appeared in, in meta, meta gaming, which is pretty cool. Mm. We didn't, you no longer saw your usual Royal Paladin, Kagero, yeah. and Shadow Paladin. A lot of people are playing uh, Force. Yep, thanks to having Blum Bros. Bros. And also, the Shadow was released around the same time, yep. which you have access to your on strike unit, and now you have Blum Bros. And yeah, it's good, it's very good. Mm -hmm. Yep, yeah. so. That is uh, it. What is that? So with GPT-02, um, very sad, it did not help Neon Actor do anything at all. It made them, you get them Jingle Flower, but then they, they still died for the same reason they died before, which was retiring. Yeah. And now you have Binding, which is worse. Mm. Yeah, so, but it definitely did, did a pave way for Aqua Force to be meta. Which, and uh, mm. interestingly for Vanguard G series, right, uh, yes. Neon Actor was surprisingly, yes. nobody expected there would be a third clan in the series. Yes. I oh, said main character, right? Yeah. yeah. Nobody expected, but giving such a boost, uh, I guess, it was pretty nice. Yeah, yeah definitely. It's in the very first female 
protagonist clan being known actor, you know. Yeah, Back so then, your actor was right underwhelming. Yeah, yeah, you had uh, what the weed guys using in season two. Season two. Yeah, Marky using it in season three. Yeah, Musketeers, um, Legion season. Yeah. Did he use Yes, yes. Sarah. Oh, Sarah, Sarah used Musketeers. Yes. So, um, and it wasn't the main character thing. Yeah. I mean, it's understandable, you had Genesis and OTT, but yeah, so now Nectar gets a bit of good. Junior Flower is really good. Yeah, really spotlight. Really yeah, it's, it's really good that they get a lot of spotlight. Yeah. Yep, definitely. So, yeah, and uh, yes, that does that round thing up. I think so, what's round about it? Yeah. So, do stay tuned, do subscribe, do like our channel. Yeah. For upcoming booster sets, uh, we showcase more. And uh, do do check out our Facebook page. Yes, we have a Facebook page. Yep, all links in the description. Yep. Uh, so out. until then, see you next time. Bye. Bye.